What did you get Mila for Valentine's Day? Do y'all do? Do y'all exchange gifts still? Tonight. I know, I know, but she won't. She doesn't watch. I'm not. I she am doesn't. not. I'm not brave. No, no, I'm not risking it. I've done do you this have, before. Do, I feel like she might like meaningful. I feel like what do you get each other? You've been together for so long. She's like, like a really okay. See, here's the thing. She's like a really. Um, She's a very specific gift giver. Like, it's not about, like, what something is, how big it is. It's, like, not about the show. It's about, like, does it have meaning? Like, Absolutely. example, so for Christmas, she was, like, her best friend and her uh, manager, they used to always have this emergency place that they would go to if there was ever an emergency, and it was in front of Lucille Ball's house, like, right in Beverly Hills. Like, if there was an emergency, <laughs> let's meet in front of Lucille Ball's house. That was the thing. Th so, this is the actual incredible part of the story, by the way. Okay, <laughs> like, so but, but okay, so here's the thing. So we're drive we drive by this house every day on the way to take our kids to school. Yeah. And she's like, and one day we drive by and they're tearing the house down, and we're like, oh my god, they're tearing down Lucille Ball's house. Like we, and she's like, I I need to go. I I need for for Christmas. I need to get them the bricks from Lucille Ball's house because they're tearing it down. And I'm oh, I'm thinking to myself sweet. like. How are we gonna get the bricks from? It's like a construction site, it's all fenced off. So I sneak into the construction site <laughs> and I steal like three bricks from the construction it's a good site. Man. This is and a I'm good like, man. Go, and I put them in the back of my truck and I go home, like, baby, I got something for you. I got you the bricks. And so, and she's like, oh my God, you got me these bricks. This is the most amazing thing in the world. So she packages them up and puts them in these little boxes and puts a little tab, says Lucille Balls house on it and then gives it to her friends. She gives it to her friend and we find out that wasn't Lucille Ball's house. That was the house across the street from Lucille Ball's house. <laughs> and so I stole some random bricks from Eddie Cantor's house. And I'm like, what is going on? Like I, but Which makes it a way better story. Yeah, it does. Make, so then yeah. she changed the plaque and it says not Lucille Ball's house. <laughs> <laughs> on it. And so, but those are the kind of sentimental things. So it's, it's very detail oriented. I think that's very cool. It's, I'm the same way. I mean, I feel like at this point we can buy whatever we want. It's like the meaningful stuff. Is it's cool. got to be meaningful. It's yeah. got to have like some resonance. Even if you're, the, it's intentional, but it's an, another house. Even if it's not <laughs> Lucille Ball's house. Yeah, it's fine. I just love that they, that was their meeting place. That's going to be that a question next time I talk to her.